How's it going everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are on the ice again. Got some homies, we found some more safe ice and uh, we made our way out here, obviously using those safety precautions. If you guys wanna look at safety videos, um, I'll leave some in the link below. But we got myself, Sam, Luke, and Dustin here and uh, we're at my favorite early ice hall. I'm sure a lot of you people know this. This is kind of like the community hall as we like to call it. But let's go check on Sam. Oh, John, you ready for this? Are you about the whack one? Yeah, I was, I don't know. <clears throat> There's none on the screen right now, but. Oh, hey, Dust. My first walleye of the season. It's a spotted walleye. Uh, we're gonna let her go. How long have we been here, Dustin? Four or five hours. That's the first fish we caught. Okay. Now we've been here about three minutes. Sam, what are we doing today, man? Today we're ice fishing for some big crappies and big bluegill, supposedly. I just dropped down here. I'm at the first hole, and uh, I'm not marking anything right now, but I could move around and uh, find some fish. Oh, here comes the mark. No, it was just interference. Oh, what? no, that's actually a mark. Wait, what? Johnny? Johnny? He doesn't want to come up. Cheeks. Hey, you. Oh, there's another mark. I knew there'd be some out here. Did he, he up bite up? you? Yeah, he bit it upwards. Ooh, that's a nice one, dude. Oh, wow. Oh, hey, came unhooked. Woo -hoo -hoo. Poppy, look at that one. That is a good looking first early ice crappie right there, boy. Sheesh. That ain't bad. What is he? 10, you think? Yeah, I mean, yeah. that's probably the average, honestly. Yeah, that, this is average. There's more down there. Sweet. Yeah, drop back down there real we quick. We can keep them on the ice for right now. Oh yeah, it's, it's nice and warm out. Oh, that's a good one, Sam. It's like 40 degrees out. This is another big mark down there. Okay, first 10 inch crappie. He's a good eater. We are gonna harvest a couple of them. We're not gonna keep our limit, but just a couple. Well, that's a good way to start the video. Um, this spot's absolutely loaded with bluegills, uh, crappies. There's also bass, walleye, and pike that do roam through here. So I might possibly set up the iFish Pro for you guys. But I'm gonna get the camera rolling for Sam, and you guys stay tuned. It's early ice season, baby. All right, before we go any farther, guys, I just want to kind of show you uh, what we're fishing, how we're fishing them, and uh, how we find these fish. So the first thing I do is I drill a hole and I look at my Garmin. As you can already see, there are some fish on the screen right there. Uh, that looks like a tree or some, that's definitely weeds right there, but those are fish. So what I'll do is I'll take this guy right here and I'll spin it around and try to find some other fish so let me see if i can find some for you guys real quick so right there they are absolutely stacked on that on that big weed right there all of those marks to the right are fish so once we locate the fish with the garmin we go over there drill a hole according to how far away they are and someone brings a little vexlar because it's a lot more portable and they bring their favorite frostbite rod drop down and catch some fish just as easy as that He's right on. Oh, big bite, and I won't whiffed it. Oh, buddy, cranked her. <laughs> Dustin, there's a couple down here. Another nice little crappie. Let's get them back in the water. There is a lot of fish still down there, and I hooked my bibs. So, yeah. Let's just drop down there. No plastic. And that school is gone. What a shame. Oh, I, I had a, uh, a plastic called the dragonfly, also red frostbite, which I'm going to put back on because I have been catching a bunch of fish. I'm thinking that these fish are really fired up. He's coming up to eight feet of water. Try a ripping rat. Oh, a big ripping rat. There's another nice crappie. Come on, get your head through the hole there, buddy. Well, thanks, Dustin. Another nice, beautiful little crappie that Dustin let me catch. Sweet, going back in. See you later, my dude. Here comes two or three. We're gonna raise up to the high one, though. Yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. He wants it. Drop down there. Fit it upwards. Slapped you. The ultimate teamwork, man. Yeah. Gotta keep the school hungry. Oh, God, yeah. Here we go. Oh, you're gonna clap one. Slap. 
Ooh, is that a nice one? It is it was nice way one. over there. That is a nice one, though. Heck yeah. Keep her going. Get keep a whole the bunch train of marks, going. So me and Sam are just keeping them entertained while one person unhooks a fish and takes care of it. The other person drops down and keeps the school around. He's about it. What? Let me smack that thing. There he is. Yes, sir. Bluegill? Ooh, it is a bluegill. Oh. Of course, when I pull up, there comes a mark. I'm gonna drop right back on him. He's coming up. Oh, there's a big school. Smoked her. Ooh, that might be a tanker. Oh, that's not a bad one. Another nice crappie. Bit it upward, hard to feel. That one's gonna be good table fare too. We got one on the ice, so we might as well keep it up there. Well, John's on a mega school right here, so I'm gonna go leech off of him. Oh yeah, there's fish down there. Holy cow. Drop down right on his nostril. Didn't want the smoke. Oh, he nipped it. Just a fatty school. Ooh, another copy at the hole. There he goes. Ooh, that might be a decent one. Ooh, what do we got going on here, Rick? He ain't bad. You can see him through the ice. Look at that. That's cool. This is cool. Here comes the mark. Big old mark. Oh my god. What? That's Spain without the S boys. I think there's two more coming up. Not as big of marks as the last one though, that's sad. There we go. Ooh, he's digging. Oh, oh, what is this? I don't know, it's big. Oh, it's largey. It's a green guy. Come here, green guy. Mr. Green Guy wanted to play. I say, if you were a bluegill, you were big. I should get down there. No plastic, though. Let's we'll see how this goes. Oh, that would be a fish on me. Heh. <laughs> Here he comes. No? Hurry up. There he is. There we go. Bluegill. Nice bluegill too. Yeah. Look at that bluegill. That is a beautiful. Hey, chill. John, is that a drake? I'm just doing a fish shimmy. No, I'm kind of interested to see what a fish shimmy is. You have to make one full circle around the hole. Gone. He gone. He don't want the smoke. There's fish. Yep. How's that possible? There we go. Ooh. Ooh. Very nice. He'll be good table fare. John. Line was moving a second ago. 
Another eye fish. I kind of want to see this. What if it's big? Odds is another bass? Hmm. Hmm. Oh god, I don't think I feel them now. Nothing? Nothing. Rip. What's that start, guy? Oh, I got baited. Your minnow's gone. I got jabated. Rip. Oh! You shall go grab it. <laughs> Alright, I actually catch it though. It's no, wrong. you catch it. I don't want to catch it. So yeah. I don't either. Should we watch it? Yeah. Alright. I saw you. Alright. All right. All right. John's iFish Pro went up and I'm going to leech it. You shall. Because I'm a bass. Because I'm a bass fisherman. And there ain't nothing on. Cause it was a fall all flag. And me and Sam sat down and fought over it. No, he didn't fight over it. I told you to go get it. That is true. Man, there ain't no fish over here. That also sucks. Super suspended one. Bit it upwards. It's gotta be a crappie. Yep. It is. Just a little salt and pepper. Beautiful fish. Still a lot down there. Uh, I fished pro enough. Johnny wants me to get it though. I don't see the line ripping. Oh, she's going now. Now she stopped. Let's go lightly. There he is. Whatever it is. So it's a it's a large oh, it just snapped me off. There he goes. Come back. Oh no. Snapped us off, Johnny. How's it going? How did today go for you, bud? They didn't, the fans didn't really see much of me because I was filming a frostbite video. Right, but they saw a lot of me and a lot of fish being caught through the ice. This early ice, Dustin and I were on a good school over there where he would drop down, he'd catch one while he's unhooking it, I would drop down and catch one and then we'd just flip flop back and forth. So we stayed on that school for a while and then I just kind of hole hopped around and caught some bass on the tip up and couldn't complain man, it was pretty good. But we got some harvesters. We're gonna do a little catch clean cook when we get back to the house. So we are gonna go clean the fish, but if you guys do wanna go watch us clean the fish, we'll leave the link down below to uncut where we can post that stuff. But here on YouTube, we can't show us cleaning the fish. So if you guys wanna go watch that, the link will be down below. If not, we will see you guys back at the house. Boo -boo -boo what are we doing here? How's it going, guys? We're not right. in Fargo anymore. Not in Fargo anymore, but Sam and I are still together. We made the journey back to South Dakota because it's Thanksgiving, had to spend time with the family. But we wanted to cook some of those crappies that you guys saw us whack. Well, that you saw Sam whack. Let's check them out. Oh, yeah. Those look really nice and juicy. And if remember, if you guys want to see how we clean these, that will be on the uncut link down below. Uh, that was a really funny ordeal cleaning these things, but check that out. Uh, we're gonna cook these bad boys now, but we have something new that we wanna show you guys what we're gonna be cooking with today. Today, we got catch and cook coatings, okay? This is the original crunchy version. They make a couple other versions as well as some seasonings. Our buddy Jay actually came up with this company, so you should go support him. It's really good. We've used this a bunch of times before, um, so we're gonna show you our favorite way to use this. All right, we got our crappie fillets. We just rinsed them off, and uh, they're nice and dry. We pat them off, but we got some buttermilk. I like using buttermilk instead of egg wash, so we're just gonna dip our crappie fillets in there. Oh, those look good, in there bro. Nice. We're just gonna let that sit in there for about 10 minutes, kind of let it soak it up, and uh, then we're gonna dip it into the catch and cook seasoning. Daisy, you wanna give it a sniff? Oh yeah. She likes it. She does. All right, our crappies have been soaking up in this lovely buttermilk. I'm just gonna drizzle some of it off. Place it in the bag with our catch and cook. Looks so tasty, Do bro. Do you smell that, dude? When I open the bag, it just Oh wham. yeah. Look at the goodness in there. Closer, get that nice little ear pocket, and we're just gonna shake her up. 
Make sure you get that catch and cook coat in all over the fish. Ah. Woo, look at that. Good coating, all right. Here we got a pan with oil. We're using vegetable oil. Uh, it cooks a little bit better, but it seems to be a little too hot, John. Yeah, that's why I'm staying back here. We're just gonna let it cool down and we're gonna get right back to it. All right, we're gonna take our first fillet here. Look at that thing, it looks good. We're gonna lay it down in the oil away from us. See, if I would've done it towards me, that would not have been good. We would've ended up like Parrot. Um, okay, yeah. Just oil going everywhere. Mom's gonna be real happy. I'll clean it up. I'm a good cleaner. Woo! Does that not look really good? Ooh. Those look tasty. Dad, does that look good? It smells good. Yeah. Hey, do the TikTok trend where, have you seen it where you just stare at your dog and bark really loud at it and see what they do? Bro! Bro! She don't want this smoke, boys. All right. I think that's the that. one that just, oh, it looks crunchy. Oh, this is gonna be scorching. But, oh wait, I'm gonna grab, grab a cooler one. Yeah. Oh yeah, this, oh. oh. Okay. Okay, that looks really white and flaky, first off. Oh yeah. Mm. That coating is gonna, looks delicious. Mmm. Dude, we didn't even do a post like sprinkle of salt or anything. Mm, no. It's just how the, the coating is. Gas. Doesn't need it. I'm not even lying, dude. That's really freaking good. It's a good switch up from like mm. the other batters. No, it don't taste like sour lunch or anything else. Boy, you need some AC in your mouth. I do need some AC, but this is definitely better. You need to check it out. Ooh, look at that boy. Look at that. Ooh, all right. Cheers. Do you hear the crunch? Oh yeah. So good. Mmm. Whatever Jay has it seasoned with in there, it hits the spot. So, uh... Nice. So this is crappie? Yeah. Sam caught it. Cold Sam caught crappie. Uh, Cold water crappie. Uh, nice. I, I think, do you, I, like, you're not really a huge ice fisherman, but you've kind of always been nagging me and Sam to take you. So maybe this year we'll have to bring you out on excursion. <coughs> okay. I think the fans will like it. Drop a comment down below if you want to see this guy go ice fishing, because I think that'd be funny. <laughs> All right, we just got done eating our lovely crappie. It was absolutely delicious, and I hope that the ice will stay safe so we can continue going out there and catch some more fish. And I hope if you guys are going out, you guys are staying safe and using all of your safety precautions. Daisy, you got anything to say? Okay, well, John, thank you for inviting me up to Fargo so we can go fishing. And uh, hopefully I can find safe ice down here, but thank you for watching today's video. I'll we'll catch you guys on the next one. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Don't want the dog to get these. <laughs>